Hello again, everyone, and welcome back to Dragon Age Inquisition. We are back here in Skyhold, and, um, yeah, what we're going to do... Um, also, it's glad to be back. I do apologize for the bit of a hiatus. I have been quite busy. I've been uh, out uh, doing a walk for charity, so I was away in the Lake District for a while, so I was not able to upload or anything like that. But, uh, yeah, so what we're going to do first is we're going to go back to our war table. Make sure that all of our advisors are doing something if they are able to. Then what I think we're going to do is going to go turn in some research. Because I, I feel like we haven't done that in a while. So if we, if, we, if we can get any damage bonuses against enemies, we want it, don't we? Let's be honest. Um, and then we can go back to Empire's du Lyon and uh, sort that out. Um... Regeni attends a party. It appears our detracting lord found shame in the dark thanks to a scandalous laugh. Also, blind feats fates are now the rage. Can Regeni claim that all air remains all air? Okay. Ah, so we can restore Judicale's crossing in uh, the Empress de Leon. Ambassador Montilia, we the members of the All Asian Society for the Protection of Historic Historic Architecture would like to draw your attention to the deplorable state of Judicale's Crossing. The bridge was constructed in 856 Blessed as part of the festivities surrounding the first anniversary of the coronation of Emperor Judicale I, and for nearly an age it has been considered the greatest triumph of All Asian engineering. Now it lies in ruins, shattered by monstrous rebels of the Templar Order. You cannot allow this grave injustice to stand, Ambassador. The Crown is too involved in, in civil war to properly care for our historic landmarks. But the Inquisition will surely come to the aid of, aid, to the, aid of the people. Uh, with hope, Duchess Nicole de Val Montagne. I have something for you, Commander. The soldiers the Herald rescued from the Falamion arrived an hour ago. Thank the Maker. More, more troops. Good stuff. <clears throat> In another hand at the bottom of the letter, Cullen. Can we handle this, please? I'm receiving 19 of these letters a day, Josephine. <laughs> we'll get the engineers on it. Commander, repairs to the damaged bridge at Judicale's Crossing are complete, although we ran into some complications. The workers were spooked by sightings of dragons flying around the site, so we brought in Tamar for extra security. She did a good enough job, but next time I think we'll call in anybody else. That woman doesn't just frighten dragons, if you know what I mean, Captain Mathis. So, not now. So I'm guessing over Judicale's Crossing we will have another dragon fight uh, to look forward to in Empress de Leon, so... Yeah. We can do that at some point, can't we? We've uh, we've killed two dragons so far, and I think we're doing pr a pretty good job in that regard. So, don't think we have any other advisors to send out on any missions, so we'll leave that for now. And let's go and turn in some creature research of some description. Sarah slightly approves of the Red Jenny malarkey. Great. I'm so, like, undecided on Sarah. Like... She's clearly a woman of the people, but she's also so annoying. Like, really, she is to me. She's really annoying. I don't know. She just feels like she just speaks in riddles consistently as well, which is never, uh, never good. <laughs> Helism. Oh, no, I just need to turn my research, don't I? Dormant Red Lyrian removed. Was that literally all I had? Maybe I, maybe I, I, I did that a lot earlier than what I thought I did. A request has been made of you in here it is. Oh no, we have loads more. That's good. Yes, Inquisitor. Damage bonus against beasts. Red Templar foot soldiers. Damage bonus against undead. No creature research on to remove. Did. Was that a new operation we just got there, or was that just something else? Because she said she said she said a request had been made, and normally when it's her, it's something in regards to collecting resources or plants for her on the war table. I'll just have one more look, and if there's nothing, we'll just head to Empress de Leon. What's our inventory like? Is it quite full? No, we've only got 15 items in there. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. No rush in the slightest. I realise we'll have to go back to the uh, to the, the the descent at some point as well into the uh, deep roads. See how shape of vault is getting on with the guardian since we've left her down there for a while. <laughs> uh, red time not something. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that yet. Um, no, it, it doesn't look like we've had any, had any more 
the operations, that's fine. Grande. So let's, uh, well, map. Let's go back to Empress de Lyon. Uh, so we've got a quest up here, the Stalker, and there is Mama's Ring as well. We'll go and get Mama's Ring, shall we? Let's go and get Mama's Ring. Let's take our usual trio. Our usual triumphant trio. Is the friends of Red Jenny. I must say I'm really happy that that um that the loading screens are much better since I since I started playing this game on the on the on my newer PC because I, I remember it was her horrific last time. Yes, yeah, so I just need to give Mama back her ring. I never noticed how 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 nice and purple my armor looks. I look like an elite from Halo. Whoa! What the hell happened there? Granny Mae. There we are. Well, almost at level 20 as well, which is good. I, I, will, I will leave you, you to your chanting. Right, so find the ruins mentioned in the Hunter's Note. We've been in that in that direction for a while before. Uh, Cole, Cole's approved of that, so that's good. So what what is this quest that we are going to do now? So, yeah, so, so this is a hunter which has been stalking some prey of some description, but I don't know if the prey is an animal, is it a person, could be anything, we, 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 we don't really know yet, I'm sure we'll find out soon. I mean, I don't know how long ago th those notes were written, but we'll see, I'm sure we'll find out. Go across this bridge. These must be the ruins here, this little structure. It looks looks slightly worn down, but oh hello. Door inside to pop in front of me there. Is that obsidian? No, it's bloodstone. I, I don't think obsidian can be mined around here. Find the hunter. There's a note here. A note ripped to bits by an angry hand. Piece back together, it reads, Leave me alone or I swear I'll kill you. Oh. Hands we're flanking. Okay, so so we got a, f a few items out of the out of the equation. Um, uh, that was a weird quest, wasn't it? So was that note just left for the hunter, basically saying, you know, go away, leave me alone? That seems to be the uh, the the case anyway. Um, right. So we were heading in this direction, weren't we? I think. I, yeah, I think the tower camp was the one we were last at. Uh, should we go? Should we go over to Judic over Judical's crossing? Yeah, might as well. If we if we run into a dragon, we run into a dragon. At least we at least we have plenty of health potions to keep us going this time. As we now have twelve, was uh, and I'm pretty sure the last few last few last couple of encounters with dragons, we we I, th I think we only had six, was it? I think. So we've uh, we've got a, a good a good supply of um, of restoratives now. Yeah, I feel like yeah this. The fact that the report said said there were sightings of dragons flying around has me kind of pretty convinced that this is that this is going to lead to a dragon fight somehow. But you know, it's a bit boring if we didn't have dragons to look forward to. As 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 previously explained, especially in a game called Dragon Age, it's uh, be pretty pretty surprising if there wasn't it wasn't any dragons around to fight, wasn't there? Ah uh, yes, I can I can see the dragon. I can see two dragons. Right. Okay. 
the fact that I now see two dragons has me a bit worried. Not this gonna lie. Okay. Right, so there must be something under the bridge then. That might be related to the quest we were we had over here, I think. Because it did talk about something under a bridge, didn't it? Is it here? Amulet of Death Cipher. Every time an enemy dies nearby, the wearer of this amulet gains health and stamina. That's 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 quite a good amulet, that actually. What uh, what what amulets do we have right now? Dexterity, willpower, Varric, stamina, Cassandra. Mm. Yeah, we'll give that to Cassandra because she she she's always going to be in the thick of it, isn't she? So we'll uh, we'll leave that with her. And let's let's carry on down this area. There's a landmark up ahead that we can unlock, and then we can P pools of the sun. Interesting. Uh, claim. Hector in his time of dying. Hector is one of the Chantry's anointed. In Andraste's time, he was Lord of Navarra and one of the Prophet's most loyal followers. According to some Orlesian legends, when Maferath betrayed Andraste and Tavinta ca captured her at Hector's stronghold in Navarra, Hector leapt to her defense and was shot full of arrows. He survived long enough to see Tavinta's soldiers drag Andraste away. In this particular depiction, Hector appears as a young man, sorry, as a young and handsome man, lounging in a position many consider inappropriate to the depicted subject. Some have decided, sorry, some have decried the statue, arguing that Hector seems to be greeting a lover rather than grieving the betrayal of his prophets. I mean, yeah, he does, he does have that paint me like one of your French girls poses going on, doesn't he? Rather than, oh, oh God, I'm, 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 I'm so gutted, you know? Yeah, it's, it's yeah, <laughs> yeah, I'm not, uh, I'm. I'm 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 not fully convinced by the uh, by the alleged I don't know what's the word I'm looking for story surrounding that pose Dawnstone we don't get much Dawnstone do we memory serves there's quite a bit growing around here. I heard a noise. What what was that noise that I just heard? I feel like it may have been a dragon, but I'm What the hell is that? How is that Wait, can you get underneath these rocks? I mean it looks like you might be able to, but it's it's it would be quite tough. I feel like I'm very much like off the beaten path here when 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 I'm Exploring these uh, these little rocky areas here. I think Dawnstone was what was, was what was used to make this this armor that I'm wearing. Just based on the color, can't quite remember what I crafted it with. Oh, is that a rift? It's a rift over there, isn't it? Hmm. Okay. Well, we can go and close the rift. Definitely go and close the rift. That should be one of our prime prime concerns. That that that's probably the noise I'm hearing as well. It might be an ogre, actually. Not an ogre, sorry. A uh, pride demon. Ogres are darkspawn. I need, I need to keep on remembering the difference. Bonk. I mean, why not? Why not? Yeah, that was... That was a pretty swift destruction of all the uh, demon forces there. We just get stealthed again. Oh, God. These guys just... These guys just... Just, just look grotesque. They really do. Oh, 
fear demon. Hmm. Yeah. I can. Uh, I can see. I can see why they're called fear demons. They're. Uh, they. They, they would definitely inst instill fear into people. Just with their appearance alone, I think. Right, so, so that's achievement earned. Veteran, that's us, us, us are now at level 20, which is excellent. Excellent work, I think. Um, I'm not quite sure what the level cap is in this game, but level 20 seems a nice kind of milestone to reach. Um, oh, Falandaris! Ah, we need that for the uh, for the quest back in the Emerald Graves, don't we? Yes, we do. I remember. We need to put some Falandaris down at a, at a, at a, at a like a memorial. The name Falandaris is Elven, meaning demon weed, uh, which is fitting for this rare plant because it grows only in places where the veil is thin. Falandaris is easily identified. It's a twisted, wicked-looking shrub with long, thorny shoots and no leaves. A skeletal hand reaching out from an unmarked grave. Many swear the plant radiates a palpable aura of malevolence. So it comes as no surprise that it unnerves many a junior herbalist. Yeah, probably not the nicest looking thing. Black Wolf. Uh, oh yeah, this is just the research damage, isn't it, I think. Uh, Ghoul. Yeah, we unlocked the research there. Red Templar Archers and Foot Soldiers. Yep. Um, cool. Okay. Right. Anything else a little bit further north? I'm going to try and cover as much of this area as possible, but it is... It seems quite open, this, this place, so... If I miss something, I wouldn't be massively surprised. I'll tell you what I will do first. I will upgrade my character before I forget. Uh, what else? What do we use quite often? We use flank attack uh, quite a bit, don't we? So we'll upgrade that. Uh, before your target turns face, your blow you moves to stealth, impossible to find. That's quite good. Your flank attack leaves the targets of the blow still bleeding from the cuts your daggers find. Yeah, we'll, 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 we'll put that on. Bit of bleeding. Helps my helps my assassin tendencies. That's probably what my kind of character archetype is at the minute, just like a just like an assassin. What's that? What, what fucking material is this? I mean, I I can't I can't actually click on it. So, um, yeah, I. I don't actually know what that is, because I can't, yeah, I can't, I, I, I can't physically click on it, so I'm not sure. That's fine. Uh, ah, it was silver, right? Just for some reason I couldn't, I couldn't uh, pick it up before. Right, so around the other side of these rocks, looks like there's some enemies. Could well be Red Templars, could be something else. Um, yeah, it's Red Templars. Should have expected it to be Red Templars, really. These... Like, those, like, husks are barely fucking people anymore, are they? Like, real, like, they're, they're, they're really not. I don't, I don't understand how, like, they can even, even be considered people. Really. They just look grotesque. Let's get a bit of healing on me. Right, are we good? I think we're good. Loot these bad boys. Sense red lure. Are the dragons still flying overhead? Yes, they are. Nice, nice, nice. Well, not nice. Not nice at all, in fact. God, this this goes on a while, doesn't it? I thought I thought this would be, was going to be quite like a small area this uh, over, over this bridge, but in, but no, it's 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 big. There's there's a lot of stuff going on down here. It's definitely caught me by surprise. So we should probably kind of canvas this this area, area before we go down that that ramp or the hill, I guess. That's fucking everywhere, isn't it? Le Leontine's ring. Hello. Oh shit. There's a dragon down there. Right. 
Okay, then. Right. So I think what we're going to do... So we're going to leave this episode here. Next episode, we're going to have a, a little bit of a creepy creep down there and see if we can catch this dragon off guard and maybe take it out if possible. Maybe. Right. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I do hope you have enjoyed. If you have, then please like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I shall catch you all in the next episode of Dragon Age Inquisition. Thanks again, guys. Have a good day. Bye-bye.